Hey guys, well, welcome to another quickie video thing. Um, so today, using Sam's again just because I was too lazy to learn another deck because fuck it. So I was like, eh, I'm just quick go with Sam's because I love using Sam's. Because, you know, like I said, I like the deck. So anyways, my leadoff hand is actually pretty decent. So I can get off a first turn Shien and then I can set a couple back rows and I should be safe with the judgment and the warning and my one gate from Xi'an, so not really fearing too much. He sets down two cards and a monster, so that's what's gonna happen. I don't know, but I MST the second one, and it's a fucking mirror force, so I can use Xi'an's gate on the second uh, card he has face down, so that's always nice. But he has Mass Dragon, so he's running some type of Dragon variant, which is okay. I'll live with that. I don't really have any opposition to it. And, uh, yeah, I have Reborn in my hand. I don't know why I just realized that, but yeah. And he summons out Cyber Dark Keel. I could have warning that, but I was like, I don't even know what this thing is really doing. And then it turns out he grabs that thing, and now he's at 2200. And I'm like, oh, I probably should have warning to that. But, oh well, I can at least kill it off next turn. And yeah, I don't know how to calculate my life points properly. Because I accidentally hit 99 instead of 0, and then I didn't. And then I did it 200 too much from the attack. I don't know. I, I, I was stupid. But anyways... Uh, yeah, so I lost that, but then I draw into Reborn, and I draw into an Asceticism, what I can do is I can, uh, Reborn my Kagamusha, and then I can just Asceticism out for a, uh, Naturia Beast, well, I can Asceticism for, obviously, an Elder, but then I can grab Naturia Beast, so that is actually pretty nice, because then I can just kill off Except our keel, because I can first do some damage, and he decided to just let his uh, equip sp thing die. I don't know if that's mandatory or not, but he, pr if it isn't mandatory, he should have just let the equip thing die, or let both of them die, because then he would have suffered less life point damage. So, I don't know. That might just be me, but I don't know. Anyways, sets down, or I set down Compulse, and I just kill off this thingy, and he's like, threatening Roar, and I'm like, eh, I'm gonna negate it, because you have nothing else down, so it's not like he really threatened me in any other way, shape, or form, so I'm at his fucking well, but, uh, he's gonna bring out Delta Flyer, not really anything I care about, so I'm just gonna kill it, and then that's his turn, so we'll go into his turn, and, yeah, I got a pretty good lockdown going, because he can't really set that much trap wise and he doesn't have much to set trap wise i'm kind of happy i did save that warning because now he brings out the cyber valley and now he can't even use the effects i'm like yeah fuck you and then he's like i'll fusion gate i'm like um no do not do that so that is cool with me and i get a heavy storm i'm like i don't really give a shit i'm just gonna hit him for a bunch of shit and he's like yeah i'm probably gonna lose now and i'm like all right that figures and since he can't set down any traps, I get just infinite gates all day, every day. And I'm like, ah, I don't really care about Foolish, do it. Because he needs to use a spell to probably do something, and if he doesn't, then I can just Compulse or fucking Warning. Or not Warning, just Judgment. So it's not like it's a huge deal if he gets something off. But he mills out Cyber Dragon, and he's like, Overlord Fusion. And I'm like, uh, no. <laughs> Why would I let you do that? That would be completely silly. So, let's not do that and say I didn't do that. Anyways, that's the game. And he's like, good luck down. I was going to say, or good luck down. I was going to say, yeah, just good luck. That's what I got. But, uh, another match here. I think I'm playing some Chaos Dragon variants. Just, I think it's more, uh, what the fuck is the deck called? Um, it's not Chaos Dragon, but it's Dragons. I forget what it's called, but... Eh, whatever. But anyways, he plays down a first turn feature fusion. I'm like, shit, what's going on? But he mills out two Alexandra Dragons, a blue eye or a white stone, a legend, and then a light pulsar and eclipse wyvern. So I'm thinking, wait, what? Huh? Why? But at least he has a red eyes darkness metal, so I don't know. I, I just don't see why he did that. And then he has Mirage Dragon. I'm just like, okay, so this is just some random dragon deck for the most part, it seems like. So I'm like, alright, I'm not going to worry about the, uh, fucking future fusion because i have those two uh uh warnings so i should just be able to kill off the mirage and then him for 21 so i might as well just do that and then when the thingy wants to come out i can just go for warning but he plays one day a piece which you don't expect in just a normal deck so it's just weird but uh drawing to uh, kageki and i'm like okay let's leave out kagamusha for beta first i was gonna be like all right let's just make barky in but i was like now nah, let's leave it out for bait because then i can bait out something with for warnings, so I might as well just do that, but 
plays it down a wyvern and then mills out another uh, uh what the fuck is it called red eyes and i'm like okay cool and for some reason he didn't get her a warning i'm like uh no i want to keep my warning please thank you and uh yeah future fusion still randomly on the field but he plays down reborn i'm like uh no you cannot have your light pulser get that out of my face and then he plays down a card and ends. So I can now make the Barky. And I probably should have just done it last turn anyways. But I was being weird with the fact that I wanted to bait. I don't know. I'm weird. Accept it. Then I just hit him for 25 and 18. And if he doesn't have anything to do this turn, he loses. And he's all like, I can't do anything. That's your game. So there we go. Yeah, pretty quick quickies today. Just because I wanted to get a few matches recorded. Just so I could even have a video for today. Really. So anyways... Play another guy here, and he gets the uh, first turn stiff. So, my hand, it's okay. I mean, I, since he's leading off first, I can get a Kagamusha, but then it, he doesn't have anything to play, and he plays down Wave Motion Cannon first turn. I'm like, oh, well, shit. But I'm thinking, okay, um, he's probably playing some Burn Deck esque like things, so what I'm going to do, just get out Xi'an. I was thinking about getting out Beast, but that face down does annoy me a little bit so I'd rather have the opportunity to negate that one face down right there as opposed to having the infinite negates later on but it turns out it's just MST and I'm like eh he's probably I was thinking do I want to actually and I'm like yeah let's negate it because I wasn't sure if uh he would have any and I kind of wish that I did play down beast there because as you saw all he played was fucking spells so that would have been really nice if I did but now what I'm just going to do is going to grab a Kageki, and then I'm just going to randomly use this effect to bring out the Elder, and I'm just going to overlay them for the uh, Leviathan. I'm like, alright, let's just attach Elder for no reason, and hit him for 25. Go! And, yeah, he plays out another face down. I think I'm just going to attack him because I have nothing better to do, and all my back rows aren't really going to help me right now. Any Mirror Forces... I can't do anything about it, so I, I accidentally hit attack button, because I'm stupid. And then he's all like, yeah, wave motion cannon, and he actually plays down a monster. Who knew he would do that? But pull into a smoke, I'm like, alright, well, let's grab a hand, because two attacks from hand will kill him. I have the compulse, and if he really wants to normal summon something, I have a warning face down. So I can just hit him for 16, and there we go. And uh, th there's watchers, and things, and people... And he plays down a face down again. I'm all like, oh, let's just use hand to kill your face down monster. And it's one, that one nurse thing that makes it so anything I gain, I actually lose. And he's all like, oh, I'm going to hit a coin button that doesn't actually make this game go any better. I wasn't actually even paying attention to what that card even did. I was just like, oh, it's probably game. But I decided to side out actually for once in my life. And he decides to want to go to game two. But I side out. Uh, an elder for uh, the, the Shogun Shien, because you can tell by his deck type, it'll be important if I can lock him down like that. So he's deciding who to go, and I'm like, why don't you just fucking go? And he does fucking go, so it's like, okay, why did it take so long to do that? Anyways, this hand I'm okay with, because I can get a first turn Shien going, and because of his effect, I lose a thousand, while well, he gets to get a free card, so that's like, oh, fun. And he gets wave motion cannon and two face downs, I'm like, okay, um... I'm just going to go for, I was thinking if I wanted to go for Beast or if I want to do something else, but then I see he plays on Gravity Bond, and I'm like, okay, now I don't want to go for anything. I mean, I could actually still go for Beast, so I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm either going to go for Beast or Shien. I think I go for Shien because I'm still scared of his face down that he has right there, so uh, it'd probably be safer just to do that and then just start poking him with uh, Kageki, so that's kind of the game plan. Now, I could have also, if I really wanted to, I could have probably made a uh, Leviathan and just did that instead. But I was like, eh, let's make Xi'an. If I can draw into something else, then maybe I'll make Leviathan or something. But at this point, poking him for 17 continuously doesn't sound like that bad of an idea because I should be able to kill him off before he kills me off. And I decided to save my negate for the turn because I think I have two warnings down anyways. I'm not too scared of him going for warning anyway, or summoning a monster, rather. So I shouldn't really need to do anything about it, I'm just like, no, leave my Kageki alone, why would you want to kill my Kageki, oh right, because it's destroying you, a fucking Kageki is destroying you, how often do you get to say Kageki destroys someone, 
But yeah, um, more stuff. He plays down face down, and he's all like, I don't know what. But I don't even play down the mirror force because there's literally no point, and I just kill his face down, and that is the end of the turn. And uh, yeah, and he gets four counters. At this point, as long as I can get an attack off, then I still have the edge, but I do, so still have the edge. And eventually, I think he's going to uh, do nothing still, and I'm all like, eh, it's just if I can hit him. I'll save that smoke for later in case he has a way to kill off Gageki somehow. And, yeah, he just quits, because he can't do anything to stop my Kageki poking, so that's kind of funny. End the match, so hope you guys enjoyed, etc, etc, etc. I'll try and use some new decks some other time, but I don't know. Just getting kind of bored of DN in general, so just trying to get out videos while we wait for the next LP, so, uh... Yeah, hope you guys enjoyed, etc, 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 rate, comment, sub, and later, guys.